fresh away My heart is ready Yes, we all go rise for this journey Rise in the morning and give you thanks and praise Almighty One, my heart is ready Yes, we all go rise for this journey Rise in the morning and give you thanks and praise Oh, we did it one time. Are you blameless? Yeah. Oh, right, right. Hallelujah. Oh, thank you, man. You did it. Good advice, actually. Remember? This is Ron. Yeah. 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 And do it tonight. Thank you. Thank you, Rachel. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Super blessing. That was all over the world. Come on. Hello, we have got it. We started like half hour late, so that means I get a half hour or so. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. Maybe like an hour. Take your time. Five minutes, put your hands yeah. up. Yeah! <laughs> 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 That's 50 minutes, that's 10 people. Yeah! <laughs> I rose too. All right. <laughs> All right, so um, I just want to talk a little bit on the New Covenant. Uh, let's see, the verse is uh, 1 uh, Corinthians uh, 14, uh, 34, let me go ahead and just read that. You guys can flip there. Uh, let your women keep silent in the churches, but they are not permitted to speak. Wait a minute, I think that's the wrong verse. <laughs> <laughs> yes, wrong verse. Skip that. Skip that. <laughs> <laughs> totally joking. <laughs> I only did that because there's more men in here right now. <laughs> Cast your stones, girls. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So seriously, though, um, uh, uh, one, First Corinthians, fourteen, <clears throat> verse twenty-six. The context is Shaul is uh, going through the uh, the correct order of the meeting when we gather, and you know how things sh should go with. Um, tongues and prophecies and all those things. And um, in verse uh, 22, I'm sorry, verse 26, after he's gone over a bunch of different things, he says, how is it then, brethren, whenever you come together, each of you to have a song, a teaching, a tongue, a revelation, an interpretation, basically whatever it is, though, let, let it, whatever it is, let it be done for edification. You know, let it be done in love. Let it be for edification. Let it be about everybody else. Mm -hmm. Not about you. About everybody else. Edification. Okay? So I felt like Yahoo was, was leading me today. And I know why now. After you shared. It fits perfectly. That I, he just, I felt like he was leading me for us to read through some psalms for the rest of the duration. We have like, I don't know, whatever time. 23 minutes. We can even go longer if you want to. But I think for at least that or a little bit longer, you know, I, you were talking about one thing you were sharing about was... You know, we go through different things in this life, you know, and sometimes we don't understand as sons and daughters, we don't understand what the father is doing with the example of, of Joseph. Sometimes they're hard, they're difficult. The mm -hmm. Psalms is full of, Tehillim is full of situations yeah. that are wonderful, that are understood, and some that are just not really understood, you know, and, and uh, we, you know, the writers go through the express situations where um, there's a whole gamut of emotions that are expressed. Mm -hmm. And... Um, this morning in the men's, men's meeting, they were talking about that, you know. Um, yeah. I think it was over there about the, you know, when we come uh, in the Mashiach and we, we move forward uh, in relationship with our Creator, that we're, you know, the most place that's alive is a place where you actually can be real and you can share your emotions and go through things and not be all stiff and rigid and, mm -hmm. you know, um, but actually be real. And so that's what I, I feel like he was leading me to do was uh, start somewhere in the room and just go start from uh, Psalm 1. And just start reading through the Psalms. And as we read, you know, it doesn't have to be a fasting. You know, when there's a Selah, that's a, mo that's a moment. Selah is a moment for pausing for a second. Mm -hmm. Selah is put there to take a moment and, and ponder what was just written. Yeah. When we come to a Selah, 
Don't be afraid to just pause for a moment and ponder what was written, what was said. And let's just think about, think uh, in conjunction with what you shared and the Psalms, just think about some of the different situations. And let's read his word out loud for a you know, duration of time together, gratification together. Yeah. As we begin with this week as we move forward. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Why don't we can start with um, Shepherd over here. Maybe just go this way. Psalm uh, 1. Yeah, start with Psalm 1, and we'll just go this way, and then we can go back, and we can just go back and forth. Yeah. Until, until we can just go until everybody's read, or we can go until 12, whatever. whatever. I mean, until we read all the Psalms. Wait, you got a spiritual guy in here. <laughs> well, you want to take over? <laughs> So, yeah, should we, I don't know how we want to do it. I'll start with it. Yeah. Uh, no, let's just go until at least everybody's read, or we can go until at least 12. It doesn't have to be like a... How many verses? Every, we usually read 10 verses each at our house, and it's, it goes really cool. Okay, you guys want to do that? And if you're close to the end of a chapter, just finish it, and then... Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That sounds good. Yeah, let's do that. It's just each, each person read read the, the chapter. So you read Psalm 1. <laughs> Jonathan, you read Psalm 2. Angelina, Psalm 3. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Down like that. Yeah, sounds yeah, good? Yeah, yeah. Good. Blessed is the man who shall not walk in the counsel of the wrong, and shall not stand in the path of sinners, and shall not sit in the seat of scoffers, but his delight in the Torah of Yahuwah, and he meditates in his Torah day and night. He shall be as a tree planted by the rivers of water, mm. that yields its fruit in its season, and whose leaves do not wither. And what, whatever he does prospers. <clears throat> the wrong, the wrong are not so, but are like the chaff which, with which the wind blows away. Therefore, the wrong shall not rise in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For he who knows the way of the righteous, but the ways of the wrong comes to naught. <coughs> <coughs> well, I, almost, I, I forgot to pray. I almost want to pray before we continue. Father, it's coming for you right now. I pray you take away any um, hindrances from the world. I pray that you would uh, loose our, our ears to hear and our eyes to see as your word. Let your word come forth in color and force. Um, that it would penetrate our minds and our ruach and our bodies to see things we haven't seen before, to penetrate in a way that the seeds would be planted deeper and more refreshed than before. And uh, as we continue to move forward in this week, and we just pray that we have a way of Come on. Why do the Gentiles rage and the peoples meditate in emptiness? The, the sovereigners of the earth take their stand, and the rulers take counsel together against yod heh and against his Messiah and say, let us tear apart their bonds and throw away their robes from us. He who is sitting in the heavens laughs. Yodhibabhe mocks at them. Then he speaks to them in his wrath and troubles them in his rage, saying, But I, I have set my so sovereign on... Sion. 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 My set-apart mountain. In inscribe, I inscribe for a law, Yodhe Vavhe, has said to me, You are my son, today I have brought you forth. Ask of me, and I make the Gentiles your inheritance, and the ends of the earth your possession. Break them with a rod of iron, dash them to pieces like a potter's vessel. And now, be wise, O sovereigners, be instructed, you, you rulers of the earth. Serve your Bape with fear, and rejoice with trembling. Kiss the sun, lest he be enraged, and you pre perish in the way. For soon his wrath is to be kindled, blessed are all those taking refuge in him. Hallelujah. Mm, I love that. Kiss the sun. Mm -hmm. Okay, Lord how, Lord, how are they increased that so many, many are they that rise up? 
up against me. Too many they be with say of my soul. There is no help for him in God's soul. But thou, Lord, art a shield for me, my glory and my lifters from the up of my head. I cried unto the Lord with my voice, and he heard me out of the holy hill from the Lord. I lay me down and slept. I awake you. For the Lord of sustain me. I will not be afraid of the of ten thousand of people that have set themselves against me and that that Arise up, Lord, save me, O my Lord, for thou hast smitten all the enemies upon the cheek of thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Dear longest unto the Lord, a blessing. Thy blessing is upon the people of the Lord. Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah. Answer me when I call, O Elohim of my righteousness. You gave me, excuse me, you gave relief to me when I was in distress. Show, show favor to me and hear my prayer. Till yeah. when, O you sons of men, would you turn my esteem to shame? Mm -hmm. Would you love emptiness, seek falsehood, Selah? But know that yod heh bab -Heh has separated a kind one for himself. yod heh bab -Heh hears when I call him. Tremble and do not sin. Speak within your heart on your bed and be still, Selah. Offer slaughterings of righteousness and trust in yod heh bab -Heh. Many are saying... Who would show us good? yod heh bab -Heh, lift up the light of your face upon us. You have put more gladness in my heart than in the season that their grain and wine increase. I lie down in peace altogether and sleep. For you alone, O yod heh bab -Heh, make me dwell in safety. Come on. Oh Yahweh, 
Do not rebuke me in your displeasure, nor discipline me in your wrath. Show favor to me, O Yahweh, for I am fading away. O Yahweh, heal me, for my bones have been troubled, and my being has been greatly troubled. And you, O Yahweh, till when? Return, O Yahweh, rescue my life. O save me for your kindness sake. For in death there is no remembrance of you, who gives you thanks in the grave. I have grown weary with my groaning. Every night I flood my bed. I drench my couch with my tears. Oh, my eye has grown dim because of grief. It grows old because of all my adversaries. Depart from me, all you workers of wickedness. For Yahweh has heard the voice of my weeping. Yahweh has heard my pleading. Yahweh receives my prayer. Let all my enemies be ashamed and greatly troubled. They turn back suddenly, ashamed. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Salim Salim. The song of the Shiriyam, the type of instrument. By Dawi, when he's saying to Yahuwah concerning Cush, Ben, Yemen. Yahuwah, my Elohim, in you I seek refuge. Save me from all my pursuers and rescue me. Lest, like a lion, you tear my soul asunder, dismembering me, dismembering with none to rescue. Yahuwah my Elohim, if I have done this, if there is injustice in my hands, if I have paid with evil those who are at peace, at shalom with me, I, who rescue my tormentors gratuitously, then let the enemy pursue my soul and overtake it. Let him trample my life to the ground and lay my soul in the dust, Selah. Rise up, Yahuwah, in your anger. Be lifted in fury against my tormentors and awaken on my behalf. According to the decree that you commanded, when the assembly of nations surrounds you, then rise above it. Return to the heights. Yahuwah will punish the peoples. Judge me, Yahuwah. Reward me according to my righteousness and my integrity. Let the evil of the wicked destroy them, but you will sustain the righteous one. For the searcher of hearts and minds is the righteous Elohim. My protection lies with Elohim, who saves the upright of heart. Elohim is a righteous judge, and Elohim is angered every day. If one does not repent, he will sharpen his sword. He has bent his bow and aimed it, and for him he prepared the instruments of death. He will use his arrows against those in hot pursuit. Behold, he conceives iniquity, is pregnant with evil schemes, but he gives birth to failure. He has dug a pit and dug it deep, only to fall into the trap of his own making. His mischief will recoil upon his own head, and upon his own skull will his violence descend. Then I will thank Yahweh according to his righteousness, and sing praises to the name of yod heh the Supreme. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. O Yahuwah, our master, how excellent is your name in all the earth, you who set your splendor above the heavens. Out of the mouth of babes and infants you have founded strength. Because of your adversaries, to put an end to enemy and avenger, for I see your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars which you have established. What is man that you remember him, and the son of man that you visit him? Yet you have made him a little less than Elohim, and have crowned him with esteem and splendor. You made him rule over the works of your hands, and you have put all at his feet, all sheep and oxen, and also the beasts of the field, the birds of the heavens, and the fish of the sea, passing through the paths of the sea. O Yahuwah, our master, how excellent is your name in all the earth. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Yahuwah. I'll give thanks to Yahweh with all my heart. I will tell about all your wonderful I will be glad and exalted. I will sing praise to your name, Zion. When my enemies turn back, they stumble and perish before you. For you uphold my cause as just, sitting on the throne as the righteous judge. You rebuke the nations, destroy the wicked, blot out their name forever and ever. The enemy is finished and ruins forever. You destroy their cities, all memory of them is lost. The Yahweh is enthroned forever. He has set up his throne for judgment. He yeah. will judge the world in righteousness. Judge the people's fairly. Yahweh is a stronghold for the oppressed, the power of strength in times of trouble. Those
those who know your name put their trust in you, but those who have not abandoned you, those who seek you, Yahweh. Sing praise to Yahweh, who lives in Zion, who proclaims his evil among the peoples. For the avenger of blood remembers them, and does not ignore the cry of the Have mercy on me, Yahweh. See how I suffer from those who hate me. You raise me from the gates of death so that I can proclaim all your praises in the gates of the daughters of Yom and rejoice in this deliverance of yours. The nations have drowned in the pit they dug, caught their own feet in the net they hid. Yahweh made himself known and executed judgment. The wicked are ensnared in the work of their own hands. The wicked will return to show all the nations that were dead. Elohim. For the poor will not always be forgotten, or the hope of the needy perish forever. Arise, Yahweh, don't let mortals prevail. Let the nations be judged in your presence. Strike them with terror, Yahweh. Let the nations know they are only king. Oh, I'm sorry, I apologize. I didn't see you over there. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good job, Emma. Good job, Emma. I remember I was the entire Psalm 8. Nice. Yeah. Awesome. I'll read from Moses. To the chief singer of Daoud, in Yahuwah I have taken refuge. Why do you say to me, flee to your mountains like a bird? For look, the wicked bend at bow. And they, they ready their arrow on a string to shoot in darkness at the upright in heart. When the foundations are destroyed, what shall the righteous do? Yahuwah is in the Kodesh Akhet. The throne of Yahuwah is in the Shemayim. Yeah. His eyes see, his eyelids examine the sons of men. Yahuwah tries the righteous. But he, but his beginning shall hate, no, his being shall hate the wicked. And the ones who love violence upon the wicked, he rains snares, fires, and sulfur, and a scorning wind 
are the portions of their cup. For Yahuwah is righteous, and he has loved righteousness. The upright shall see his face. Hallelujah. Come on. To the chief singer on Lyra, the Psalm of Dalim, say Yahuwah, for the high one is no more, for the trustworthy have ceased from among the sons of men. They speak falsehoods with each other, flattering lips and a double heart they speak. Yahuwah cuts off all flattering lips, a tongue that speaks sweating words. She said with our tongue, we be mightily. Our lips are, are our own. Who is master over us? Because of the oppression of the poor, because of the sign of the needy, I now arise, says Yahuwah. I place in safety. He pants for it. The words of Yahuwah are clean words. Silver tried in the furnace of the earth, refined seven times. You guard them, O Yahuwah. You preserve them from this generation forever. The wicked walk around on every side when worthlessness is exalted among the sons of men. Yeah. How long will you forget me, O Yahuwah? Forever? How long will you hide your face from me? How long shall I take counsel in my soul? And in sorrow in my heart daily. How long shall my enemy be exalted over me? Consider, hear me, O Yahuwah El Hai. Lighten my eyes, lest I sleep the sleep of death. Lest my enemies say I have prevailed against him. Know that trouble me rejoice when I am moved. But I have trusted in your mercy. My heart shall rejoice in your Yeshua. Yeah. I will sing unto Yahuwah because he has <laughs> dealt bountifully with me. Yeah. And the yeah. singer would sing it. Me? My turn? My turn? <coughs> Your turn. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> Number 14. To the chief singer of Dawi, the fool has said in his heart, There is no Yorewahe. Hey. They have done corruptly. They have done an abominable deed. There is no one who does good. Yorewahe, look down from the Shamaim on the sons of mankind to see if there is a wise one seeking Yorewahe. They have all turned aside. They have together become filthy. No one is doing good. Not even one. Have all the workers of wickedness no knowledge? Who eat up my people as they eat bread? And do not call on Yodhewahe. There they are in great fear, for Yodhewahe is with the generation of the righteous. You would put to shame the counsel of the poor, but Yodhewahe is his refuge. Oh, that the deliverance of Israel would be given out of Zion. When Yodhewah turns back the captivity of his people, let Yaakov rejoice. Let Israel be glad. Amen. Yeah, the Torah comes forth from Mount Zion. Amen. Psalms 15, a psalm of Daoud. Yahuwah sojourns in your... Or, Yahuwah, who sojourns in your tent, who dwells in your Kodesh mountain, he who walks blamelessly, yeah. who does righteousness, and speaks the truth in his heart, he has not slandered with his tongue, he has not done evil to his neighbor, nor lifted up a reproach against his friend, in whose eyes a retrograde one is despised, but he esteems those who revere Yahuwah. He he who swears to his own hurt and does not char change. He has not put out his silver at interest and has not taken a bribe against the innocent. He who does these is never moved. Yeah. Amazing. Okay. 
A poem of Dawood. Guard me, O Al, for I have taken refuge in you. I have said to Yahuwah, you are Yahuwah. I have no good besides you. As for the... What is that? Kodashim? Kodashim. Kodashim, who are on the earth. They are the excellent ones in whom all my delight. The sorrow of those who run after another with one, uh, the sorrow of those who run after another one are increased. I would not pour out their drink offerings of blood, nor take up their names upon my lips. Yahuwah is the portion of my inheritance and my cup. You mm -hmm. uphold my lot. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Lines have fallen to me in pleasant places. Indeed, a good inheritance is mine. Hallelujah. Yeah. I barak Yahuwah who has given me counsel. My kidneys also instruct me in the night. Ooh, hallelujah, the innermost beings. I have put Yahuwah always before me because he is at my right hand and I am not shaken. Hallelujah, no matter what, everybody. Mm -hmm. Therefore, my heart was glad and my esteem rejoices. My flesh also dwells in safety. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. For you do not leave my being in the grave. There's no death there. Hallelujah. Neither let your kind one see corruption. That's a beautiful promise. Mm -hmm. You show me the path of high. And in your presence is joy to satisfaction. Yes. Mm -hmm. And at your right hand are pleasures forever. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. chapter 15, the one um, that uh, preceded Sadie's reading, the question was, That's the one um, I read. who does sojourn in your tent? Like, who's going to tabernacle with you? And I right, thought it was right. quite fitting. Oh, oh yeah. I know. I thought the same thing. Celebrating Sukkot. Right. And it's yes. kind of giving us the protocol, or the idea, yeah. you know, right. the, the yeah. heart that he's looking for, that he wants to dwell with That's as beautiful. we continue. The feast here at Sukkot. Come on, I was totally thinking this. Yeah. That was beautiful. Yeah. I, I almost said Sukkot there, but I looked it up and it's a different word. But it means tent. Yeah, well, <laughs> Sukkot is uh, actually a, the, the definition, one of them is tabernacle. Yeah, right, right. yeah. Um, temporary <coughs> tabernacle. Um, that's the Father for His Word. Yep. Psalms is always good as uh, Ever have a uh, someone who doesn't understand that we have to still keep Torah? Have them read the Psalms. Because sometimes they'll have these New Testament Bibles that they still have the Psalms in it. Yeah. So go back and read, especially chapter one. Yeah. See what it says. Right. It's all about the Torah. It's all about his. It says, Bob, it's Torah. Come on. What, and ask them, what, is, what are they talking about? There? What's being said there? You know? What, what law? You know? <laughs> yeah. Kind of, hard, kind of hard to get away from. It. Uh, but I thank the fathers that this is a, a joyous time when you, you learned a lot. We have more that's coming. I uh, believe the fathers will open up his word even more. Inside of that, that are just uh, making uh, ground and breaking breaking ground and making taking root. And uh, the tree's going to grow and I think the fruit's going to come. And we're going to all eat from it. This is cool. I'm on. Uh, I have an uh, earnest desire to uh, share with the uh, will. We have some good things coming. Yeah. Thank you. Praise God.